Hello friends, I'm Professor Filip Kovacevic and this is the 55th edition of the Russian Newspapers Monitor. I hope you are doing well today. The fundraising drive for Newsbot is ongoing and we need your support. Please help us sustain and expand our coverage and analysis. The world is in deep systemic crisis and impartial and independent media organizations such as Newsbud are the only oasis of objective information distribution and research. Everything else is fake news with a more or less hidden partisan geopolitical agenda. Newsbud runs no ads and takes no money from foundations, corporations, and government institutions, and is free to tell you what is really going on in the world. Please give us your support. In this edition of the Russian Newspapers Monitor, I will talk about the increased political and economic cooperation between Russia and the governments of the Caribbean states. This appears to be a Russian long-term response to the U.S. meddling in Eastern Europe. I will also discuss the press conference that the Russian President Vladimir Putin gave at the recent APEC summit in Vietnam and his praise of the U.S. President Donald Trump. In addition, I will address the rumors about the potential breakup of the Russian state-owned natural gas and oil giant, Gazprom. Lastly, I will examine how the first Russian foreign minister after the collapse of the Soviet Union, Andrei Kozirev, a well-known pro-Western liberal, is seen in Russia today, including by the President Putin. Do not miss this exclusive edition of the Russian Newspapers Monitor. Mm -hmm.